to the channel uh, it's been a while since I last uploaded the video but we finally got some time to make one and this video was requested by some of you it's about lowering the rear suspension on a BMW F11 this particular car is a 2016 the car we're gonna be doing uh, the video but it applies for all the BMW F11 so without any further ado let's get into it let's do it Okay guys, so this is the 2016 BMW F11 that we're going to be um, lowering the rear suspension and we're going to be using the BMW software Insta Plus Okay Just want to open the, the program And we're gonna press new. And read out vehicle data. And just press complete identification. At the bottom. Right, so vehicle identified. Uh, 5 series with the N57 engine come on go back to the vehicle details uh, N57 engine this is a 530D okay auto yeah that's it so now we're gonna go to vehicle management here on the top press that And then we're gonna go just below service functions and then we're gonna go to chassis and suspension electronic ride height control and then we have the Ride height adjustment. Here's a trick when you press the ride height adjustment, uh, it might not work, so you need to press this one here ride height sensor check, and you'll see on this side. It started working so now we're gonna go back to the ride height adjustment press that and then here we have ride height sensor startup that's all we need right from here we're just going to choose uh, this one Carrying out ride height adjustment, we press that and then we press continue. Okay, this is just information for you to read. We press continue again, and here we're gonna choose the wheel size. We have 17 inches, we're gonna press 17 inches and then continue on the bottom then continue this is the um, rear axle 680 millimeters and the front axle 606 millimeters just press continue again and here we're gonna type the measurement from the left rear wheel in millimeters okay Right, so this is the rear left, and we're going to measure from here to here, okay? We have 60 centimeters. In millimeters will be 600 millimeters. And then, let's say I want to drop the car, uh, let's say 4 centimeters. From here to here, that's what I want to drop. So I'm gonna I'm gonna add four centimeters to the first measurement. I'm gonna add four centimeters to the sixty centimeters. 
so I'm going to tell this you that the measurement I want is going to be 640 millimeters so here we're gonna write 640 640 millimeters and then just press continue we're gonna choose the same measurement for the right rear wheel 640 press continue so now it tells us uh, confirm the entered values rear left 640 rear right 640 accept values you're gonna just press yes and then we're gonna press continue So we're just going to press continue again. Then we're just going to check what is done. And as you can see, it lowered <clears throat> what I wanted. Looks good. Unfortunately, the front cannot be adjusted, only if you change the springs or if you buy some coilovers. Yeah, this side looks good as well. Now, go back in the car. I'm going to leave the suspension standards. I'm, I'm just done this video for you guys. Uh, I'm going to put the suspension standard as it was. So I'm not going to continue with the computer. I'm just going to go back and change the measurements. But basically, uh, you just continue. Just press continue here and follow the steps. So you're going to have to measure the, the front suspension as well, <clears throat> just to inform the computer. But I'm not going to do that because as I said, the suspension is going to be standard. So I hope this video helped you guys. Uh, if so, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. And again, thanks for watching.